Well, if you are a regular user of Olama, it's a service where you can run models locally. You're going to love this. So on the hugging face, we have so many different models which are unexplored by Olama in the model section. So a brief strata of Olama, we can go to olama.com and download the installation files as per your OS. And then you can go to models and download uh, the models that is and download your required models. For example, we have the featured model here. We have the most popular model here and the newest model here. So for example, if you go to the newest model and go to Llama 3.2, and uh, on the page you can see and by running this simple command of olama run llama 3.2 on any cmd for example you can go to cmd and you can say olama run llama 3.2 using just this command you can start up an instance of llama 3.2 locally on your system so you can ask what is the capital of india And you can see the answer the india the capital of india is new delhi so using olama it's very simple to get started with the large language models locally on your system now if you say olama list you can see the list of models that i have installed on my own system but if you're using olama what i wanted to say in this video is that you have unexplored models from hugging face so in hugging face uh if you go to models there are tons of models which you can use and until now it has been a little bit of task to get started but now with the gguf format it is pretty easy so for example let me show you if you go to libraries here and go to gguf format now all these gguf format models uh, specifically 44,000 models are open for you and it's pretty easy to get started using olama because hugging face has linked up olama and it's convenient for and it's easy to download any models from the hugging face now because you can run this command now olama run hf.co or hugging face.co slash username slash repository and if you have any quantization you can add the quantization as well but first of all you need to go to the local app settings here once you go to local app settings you can go down and you can just press this olama check this olama once you check that you'll be able to do this for example let me go to this model and i've selected the gggf for example uh, let me take a model for example this let's say Sabartowski Lama 3.21 billion and once you go here you can see that uh, this is a model prepared by Bartowski and then what you can do is you can go and click here use this model and there you will see that you will have a list of uh, softwares which are applicable for this uh, use of this model so there you'll see that we have Lama olama so in the olama you can see this instruction so olama run hf.co bartowski llama 3.21 billion instruct and the gguf format now we have a tons of different format here the default is iq4xs i'm going to download this uh, q4km just copy this and once you copy this you can go ahead to any cmd let me close everything you can go to any your command terminal and what you can do is you can say olama run hf.co bartowski llama 3.21 billion instruct gguf now it's pretty easy if you have a gguf format you can just go ahead and um, do this now one issue might uh, that you might face is when uh, they don't have that particular template uh, for example if Murtowski decided that you want to include the particular template within the GGUF file, this prompt template, uh, then there is going to be issue. This is where you need to go to uh, Olama inside of Olama and create a template for yourself. So this is a Go template. You need to create a model file and there you can add this sort of a template here. 
so you create a model file and from the model inside the model file we make this from llama 3.2 and this template basically there are a host of other strings for example tool functions and tool callings that you can do this is an example of a chat ml format this is an example of a mistral format these are go language formats and it's pretty convenient because it allows for proper segregation of users assistants and system messages and the messages itself now if you go and uh, fetch a model from bartowski or the famous uh, creators then you won't have any problem so after we install this uh, we can use the model so now what happens is that it opens up a door to so many new models as you can see in olama we don't have uh, too many models there are models but if you want to try the hugging face library for example uh, sakura sakura llm if you want to try a new llm if you want to try an uncensored element then this is the way to go gguf of course if you have llama cpp if you can convert the llama cpp to gguf using the llama cpp library it is convenient as well but this has never been easy i mean just click here and then go to use this model this has never been easy for example let me show you another one let's take this lexi uncensored it has never been so easy you can go to olama here you can just copy this or previously what we had to do was we had to download the files here we had to download the gguf file and then create a model file uh, put in the template put in any system prompt that required change the temperature change the p settings so there are so many things that we had to do to get started with the model now using this it is pretty simple now this model has been completed downloads let's test this out what is the capital of japan the capital of japan is tokyo you can see this is pretty fast so if you like this video please subscribe to my channel and i will see you next time